Hello, my name is Nathan, and today we're going to be talking about directions. First of all, we have four basic directions. Up, down, left, and right. Or, north, south, west, east. Like you would find on a compass. Now, you can give basic directions like turn right, turn left, go straight ahead, go past, you will find your destination opposite of or on the corner of cross the road or cross the street. While the words street and road can be used interchangeably, you will find that the street is most commonly paved while the road may not be. Some of the questions you may hear are, how do I get to? Can you tell me where it is? I am looking for. And of course, they'll be asking about a specific place like, how can I get to the bank? Or can you tell me where the nearest ATM machine is? Or I'm looking for Main Street. And of course, when you are asking the questions, you will do the same thing. You will ask, how can I get to the bank? Or where is the closest cinema? Or I'm trying to get to the hospital. And when you are giving directions, you may say, go right or go left or go straight ahead, or go through a tunnel, or pass the crossroads. And the crossroads is where two roads meet, and you can go either way. And you may also say, turn right at the crossroads, or turn left, or take Main Street, or take the second street, or the third street. And you may say, stay on the road, for 300 meters, for example, or like 10 minutes, if you're giving an estimate of time. And of course, you'll need to use transitions like after that, or then, or when you get to, go. So for example, you would say something like, you will take the main street for about 10 minutes, then you'll turn right, and after that, you will take the first left, and when you get to the crossroads, you will take another right. And of course, you can offer some estimates, like it will take about five minutes, or it's not far away, or it is just a 10 minute walk, or a five minute bus ride, or maybe it's a little far away, it may take a while. And you will need to use landmarks. Landmarks are specific places that are unique or very obvious for someone to see. Like, you will see a large clock on the right, or you will pass a gas station. And of course, you can offer warnings like stay on the right lane, or that street is very busy, or if you pass the gas station, then you will went too far, you'll need to turn back. And if you don't know the way, you can just say, I'm sorry, I don't know, or I'm afraid I can't help you. And of course, you can offer other solutions. If you are going to the same place, you can tell someone, follow me. Or you can tell them, ask the bus driver or ask at the front desk. So next time someone asks you for directions, you can direct them to the like button and the subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. Keep watching more videos. Keep practicing your language. Thank you and goodbye.